Alright, so here's the last part of the tour. If you've been following on like a dirt. So this is a little different than any other skin types out of these two because it involves a fourth color. Now with the darker skin tones, the darkest one, you will need at least four. <laughs> four colors. Um, so that you will be able to still see his face, his shadows, all that good stuff. So first, my darkest for the shadows, I'm going to be using a blue today. You know, like sometimes you could use purple or something for like the light skin colors. Well here, I think I've tried it recently and I used blue. So a dark, dark, dark blue, like B99 or maybe um, a royal blue or something like that. But I chose B99. <laughs> Give his best. It's pale, it's less saturated than all the other blues, the least saturated. And it'll look really good. So we're going to start with the darkest color. Oh yeah, and the rest of the colors, the main colors, I'll be using the darkest uh, browns. It's just using a variety of browns in any family order, as long as it's dark and it looks like chocolate. See? You could use... The three colors I'll be using are E77, E79, and E49. E49... It's the darkest brown. Like, really, it's really dark. <laughs> um, E79, E49, like, really close. So I suggest you blend really well. Or at least make sure that um, you'll be able to see it. That's why we have this E77 here. So it'll have the lightest color to show. So that the shadows could become less obvious. And of course we use our colors blender, it's optional. But I didn't really need a colors blender. <laughs> totally fine, I'm not even going to use it. But it's optional. Alright, so for them, the light source is coming from down this way. No. The darkest part is uh, going to be this way. The light source is coming upward. So we are going to start with the blue. So... We don't need a lot of blue, but yeah, we don't need a lot. Um, this is very similar to the first to, first color to this one. Very similar to how you're gonna shade. So start off with your darkest color. Um, you could also start with your lightest color, but again, it's gonna be kind of hard. Me, it's kind of hard. Mm. And also, I recommend you know your anatomy. Um, not your anatomy, your basic color theory crap. What works with what? In this case, cool colors work best with very dark skin. Next is E49, which will emphasize the blue more, and it will be, it will show as much. It'll look more brown. You'll see in a minute what I mean. Now, Bunny here, he's kind of chunky, so we're going to have less um, details in his body because of uh, his um, double chin and everything, and his big cheeks. Oh, sorry about the background noise. My mom is asleep and, you know, they snore. Okay. See that? You can hardly, ugh. You can still see some blue, but it's not 
as a uh, visible now. He ain't a blue character. He's a brown character, y'all. You know what I mean, dude? Alright, the next one will be the E79, which will be the second lightest color. Um, another color will be optional, but you could also use E44. Um, it'll be almost like, um, a gray -ish color. It'll make his skin look shiny. Um, oh, this is horrible. But you know what I mean. <laughs> You'll see. Alright, and uh, the last thing is E77, the last one. And we're going to color it all in. I'm going to fix this up so it looks good. See, you can see double chin. See how dark chocolate he is now? To personally, um, this is kind of the easiest one out of the out of the um, dark skin colored characters because you got not only your dark color, darkest color, but your base color. Sorry, I went over the lines. I'm gonna go over that. I think guys, that's it. You get three different types. You get the caramel, the coffee, like me. You get um, the brown. That's the common. It's really common in um, dark skin tones. And then you get the dark chocolate. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Um, but it's true. There are some people that are this color. Dark. My dad's is dark. But uh, also there's the very dark ones, and uh, I suggest not to make it look like it's racist or anything. So, uh, let me see. What else should I say? Oh, also for blush, I'm not gonna add any blush really. Not to the girl, I will. Um, I'll use a red. Red would be nice. See that? Gives a nice sheen to her glow right here. Um, okay. Uh, and I'm gonna add one more color. His lips did. I was afraid it races. <laughs> uh, where's my browns? Where's my browns? We gotta use this. What would it look like? I never actually done. This is R02, by the way. I use the same thing on her, her lips. So we're going to color it, make it lighter, darker. I want it to look blended out. It was kind of weird. I don't know. I'm going to use a brown. Give it, man. Let's get brown. Oh, this is violet. Oh, God. Oh, 
Oh, I have one here. Alright, oh, let me grab a brown. Ugh. That looks so wrong. Those lips, oh my god. Oh, I'm not sure I'm going to even touch them. But I'm going to make them one. Yeah, I missed the picture. Arr. But, uh, oh, okay. I know. We'll go over to E77, I think. Will that do anything? Yeah. There we go. There we go. Much better. All right. I don't want to look, look like it's, I don't want to look, look like a racist picture or anything. So anyway, um, there you go. Alright, so that's it for this tutorial. Um, I hope you guys learned something today. I know I did. During this <laughs> How come colors? I'm like, oh my god, this doesn't look right. No, I'm joking. Um, yeah, I learned like, quite a few things. As I was doing, figuring out the color schemes. I was like, what should work, what should not work? It's always best to you guys. You guys are the artists. I can't make you do anything. So, this tutorial helps you out to guide you through your adventures of creating dark skin characters. I mean, colors, I mean, characters that do not look like they're white all the time. Or freaking Asian, like from Japanese. Because, you know, not everybody, not everybody is freaking Japanese or European or something. I'm surely I'm part European, but that's besides the point. The point is that this should help you guys. But yeah. Um. So this goes back for our tutorial. Oh, can you see? Oh God. There it is. Okay, right there. All right. So this then goes in this tutorial, and um, I hope you guys enjoy. And uh, please subscribe. Bye, guys. See you.